Hi, I'm AJ, this is LibLab, and Newton's second law can tell us how much force this hovercraft can make and how fast it can go. But what is Newton's second law? Let's find out. Newton's second law states that an object will remain in motion unless acted upon by an outside force. That seems pretty similar to Newton's first law, so what's the difference? Well, mathematically, Newton's second law says that the sum of the forces acting on an object in motion is equal to the object's mass multiplied by its acceleration, where acceleration is how an object's velocity changes over time. So, whether it gets faster or slower. So, Newton's second law says if we know what forces are acting on an object, we know how much it will speed up or slow down. Let's look at our hovercraft again. The fan on this hovercraft will apply a force on the hovercraft pushing it forward. Using a free body diagram, we can show how this force acts. In the vertical direction, the force of gravity is still balanced by the force of the air cushion under the hovercraft. But in the horizontal direction, the force of the fan pushes the hovercraft forward. By weighing the hovercraft and doing a bit of math, we can figure out how much the hovercraft is accelerating and what the force of the fan is. So, why does the hovercraft move at all? For that, we'll need to take a look at Newton's third law, but that's a topic for the next video. AJ here, host of Lib Lab, and if you liked this episode and want to see more awesome science demos like this one, do us a favor and click that thumbs up to like this video and subscribe to Lib Lab so you never miss an episode. Thanks for watching.